Welcome to our simple signature for Salesforce demo. What we're going to do today is quickly run through three different demos. The first one is just a standalone scenario where you would use an iPhone or an iPad to get a signature on a form. Press on the tab that says sign and you will be presented with a simple form, which is customizable. Both the wording on the form and the fields themselves can be changed. The person signs it and then they press the submit button. It is saved as a record in Salesforce. Back in the web version of Salesforce, in the Signatures tab, you can see or print this same record. An optional feature in the paid version is to automatically create a lead at the same time you create the signature, using the fields that are on the form. The second demo is for in-person interactions where you need a signature. In this scenario, you go to a record, for example, an opportunity, and you can have one or more buttons that will take you to a signature page in this case, you are signing to receive a quote. Again, you have customizable wording and fields. You give this to the person who is right there with you. They sign it and then get an email with an attachment that shows them the form they just signed with their signature on it. The same attachment can be automatically placed back on the record within Salesforce so that both of you will always have a backup of the signature. The final demo is for signature requests. In this scenario, you want to request a signature from a person who is not with you at the time. In this process, you start by pressing a button to request the signature. A person outside of Salesforce receives a request for signature via email and is able to sign it. In this case, we are on a contact. And when we press the button, for example, a request for an NDA, the contact gets an email. If I reload the screen, I can see that a signature request was emailed out. If I click on the record, it shows that it was requested and emailed. Now the email comes in. And if I go to Salesforce, it will tell me that my client viewed the email. Now, when your client clicks the button in the email to sign it, you will see back in Salesforce that they have clicked the button in the email and are now looking at the form. This way, we know how far along they are in the process. Once the client actually fills out the fields and signs the form back in Salesforce, I can see that the client has signed it and the process was a success. Of course, the client can also get an email, which can be completely customized with an attachment showing the document that they just signed. That's it. Please contact us if you want a personalized demo.